For at TV, the world is thinking. Rilke wrote these sonnets to Orpheus, 55 of them, in two weeks. And they're considered by most people his greatest work. Just after World War I, he's sitting there not knowing what to do with himself in this chateau in Switzerland. And he does happen, his, his lover at the time, Baladine, whoever she was, um, happened to pin on his desk a small photo of Orpheus. And suddenly, 55 sonnets to Orpheus. <laughs> yeah. So Orpheus was, is the story of transformation, dismemberment. He was torn to pieces. We all are. But he still was singing. So this is one of the sonnets, one of the 55 sonnets. Want the change. Want the change, want the change. Be inspired by the flame where everything shines as it disappears. The artist, when sketching, loves nothing, nothing, so much as the turn of the body, the curve of the body, as it turns away. The artist, when sketching, loves nothing so much as the curve of the body as it turns away. Hmm. What locks itself in sameness is congealed. Is it safer to be gray and numb? What turns hard becomes rigid and is easily shattered. Pour yourself, pour yourself, pour yourself like a fountain. Flow into the knowledge that what you are seeking finishes often at the start and with ending begins. Every happiness is the child of a separation it did not feel it could survive. And Daphne, Daphne, becoming a laurel, dares you, dares you, dares me to become the wind. The wind. Want the change. Want the change. Be like the flame where everything shines as it disappears. The artist, when sketching, loves nothing, nothing so much as the curve of the body as it turns away. What locks itself in sameness has congealed. Is it better to be, is it safer to be gray and numb? Hmm. It might feel like that sometimes. Hmm. What turns hard becomes rigid. So easily, so easily shattered. Hmm. Pour yourself like a fountain. Flow into the knowledge that what you are seeking finishes often at the start and with ending begins. Remember T.S. Eliot. Everything, every happiness is the child of a separation it did not feel it could survive. And Daphne, Daphne becoming a laurel, dares you to become the wind.